What's up everybody, my name is Jeremy Jones and I am back with another video. Today we're talking a Nike Dunk Low wash denim. So stay tuned. Hoping one day I'ma get it all right. Brother is engaged, but I start a new life. Yeah, I haven't had a chill day. Really wanna vibe, appreciate the moments. I've been creating, not scrolling. Mom and dad still support it. All right, man, I'm back with another video, man. Before I get too deep into this video, y'all already know what to do. Go and hit that like button. It really helps the channel out. And if you're new, consider subscribing. I make content about sneakers. All right, so let's dive into today's video. Just like I said in the intro, man, we're talking a Nike Dunk Low wash denim. All right, man, we're gonna be keeping things very simple over here today. We're gonna be answering the basic old question. Are they drip or skip? Let's just keep it there. All right, so first things first, these are set to release July 4th to the best of my knowledge, coming in at a retail price of $120, right? Okay, and of course, you know the kid glanced at the resale price, and right now, don't look like they're loaded up on the resale market just yet at the time that I'm shooting this video, but if I had to guess, they're gonna sit at right at retail and maybe slightly above at like 130, right? But that's just my best educated guess. I'm not a professional reseller, and y'all know how I feel about retailing in general. It's kinda, yeah, I'm not gonna go there, it's a different video, but neither here nor there, if I had to make my best guess, $130 on the resale market, right? Okay, maybe give or take. But with all that being said, if you felt like you've literally watched that video on like nike dunk like wash denim most likely you probably have right okay i can think of the last ones they did where it was a nike dunk high like denim sneaker and that was for the ladies and then i can think of an actual wash denim where i think that was more maybe that was a lady exclusive as well but now we got a low version but this one it doesn't seem like it's heavenly like denimed out again i'm gonna say this it looks like it's just focused around the nike check area in the back of the hill the rest of it seems to be like that age old like vintage slash like sale look with the sneaker kind of been like a thing that nike's kind of just been running with over the like last couple of years, which I feel like, I'm not gonna speak for the whole sneak community, but I'm gonna speak for myself. I'm borderline getting tired of like that whole, like, I don't know, like old school look, that benches look. It was nice, but it's had its run for a couple of years now. It's time to bring something new to the table. And my opinion, which again, we can go back to that great old like rule that I've been saying for like at least over a couple months now. Do they have any new ideas? And by they, I mean like Nike and or like any sneaker company right now. Is there any like new ideas out there just yet? I haven't seen that new like wow me factor thing that's like the next it thing that's about to take off. Right now the market is kind of just chill, which is a good thing right now. Like many people have probably been saying this is a good time to buy, right? Okay, if you're looking for some sneakers. But overall for these watch denims, for the kid, right? Not a bad shoe. I can see that Nike's really geared up for the summertime and like I've been saying in other videos, Nike's really just kind of hitting us with nothing but like back to back like general summer wear where it's dope for the summer but at the same time can we think like long term on these? Just like food for thought but neither here nor there for the kid personally these will be a skip. Not a bad shoe just something I wouldn't write home about. Something that where I feel like I got enough summer heat already where I don't really kind of need these so these will be a skip. But I want to know what you guys think down in the comment section. And will you be going after these on July 4th? Retailing at $120. And of course, let me know if you think they're drip or skip. All right, man, I'm going to go ahead and get up out of this thing and stop rambling, man. Y'all be sure to hit that like button. It really helps the channel out. And if you're new, consider of subscribing, I made content about sneakers. Again, my name is Jeremy Jones. And thank you for watching. And I'm out.